guys. Let's make a quick and easy pizza dough today. This is great for when you want pizza but you don't want to wait until the dough rises for an hour and it's very good. Uh, in preparation for this, I need you to preheat your oven at 450 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 230 centigrade, and to grease the pan you're gonna use for your pizza. We're going to get our yeast going for this. I have a cup of warm water here. Make sure it's not hot. You want it warm, about 110 degrees. You don't want to kill the yeast. I'm going to add a tablespoon of dry instant yeast and a tablespoon of sugar. Give it a little stir. So we leave it alone, let it get bubbly for about five minutes. Our, our yeast is nice and bubbly. I'm going to add a tablespoon of olive oil, a teaspoon of salt, two, and I'm gonna start incorporating two cups of all-purpose flour in here. As always, you will have grams and everything in the description box for this. I'm just gonna dump that two cups. We're gonna dump this onto the counter and then I have another half cup flour measured here and we'll go adding it as necessary. We're gonna sprinkle some uh, flour on the counter and we're gonna start kneading this until it's not no longer sticky. As I The amount of extra flour you're going to add is going to depend on a lot of things. You know, uh, the flour you're using, the humidity in the room. So this is why I can't say, oh, just add the half cup because we don't want this to be dry, uh, but we don't want it to be doing this either. And we use the whole thing. <laughs> We're going to let this rest for a few minutes for the gluten to relax and then we will put it onto our pan. I'm going to put a little more flour on the counter and we're going to form this dough. You can do it by hand, just like this, stretching it out, or you can use a rolling pin. Remember, this is oiled. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pre-bake this on the bottom rack for five minutes and then we will uh, top it with whatever we decide. Okay, five minutes in the oven. So now you can top this with whatever you want. I'm gonna show you what I want to eat today. I'm going to top it with Kumato tomatoes. They're so delicious right now. Obviously, if you want to put sauce on it, go ahead. Pepperoni, cheese, whatever you want. This is what I have a uh, hankering for today. So I'm gonna add slivered garlic. I'm going to drizzle it with olive oil. Some salt. A little tiny bit of oregano and a little bit of Romano cheese. <laughs> okay, call me nuts, but this is how I like to eat my pizza. Okay, so now once you've decided how you want your toppings, this goes back in the oven at the bottom again, bottom uh, rack, for 15 to 20 minutes. When it's nice and browned, we'll bring it out. 20 minutes, the dough is nicely browned. This is ready to eat. My tomatoes are beautifully roasted and my, my garlic is nicely browned. <laughs> okay. Let's taste this. This pizza is super crisp. I love it. 